All right, in this video, real quick, we're going to attach a domain to a Go High Level landing page. So I'm in my Go High Level portal. I've got a landing page. These are going to be kind of your requirements here. Uh, we're going to head over to Settings in the bottom left and then click on Domains. So the big thing is we've got our funnel. How do we attach this funnel to a landing page? We're going to use GoDaddy. So navigate in GoDaddy to your DNS management or to your domains. I've got a domain here called 716 Services. I am in my DNS management. So go to your products, go to your domains. Find how to get to this menu because we're going to need to edit a couple records in here. Uh, good news, this is it's real easy. We hit this green Add New Domain button. And all we're going to do is copy this 34.68. 234.4 and this is going to be an A record so what we're going to do there typically is going to be a park A record in here if you've never used this before so we're just going to change this to this we're going to hit save and now we're going to go back here and make a C name so a C name is a little bit of a different record C name is the information that might be in front of your domain so in this case, there's a C name for www. So we're going to change that. And then we're also going to make another C name just to kind of show you how that process works as well. So let's say we want to make uh, a direct landing page or something like that. So we could make a C name. And then instead of www, we could always make help desk or something like that. And then all we're going to do is we're just going to paste the same thing over here, flash.funnels.smessenger.com. Uh, again, just the same values we captured right from high level. And now we're going to add the record in here. So now that we've edited GoDaddy, this might take a couple seconds. It says it could take 48 hours. Usually the .coms go rather quickly. We're going to see how quickly the .services domains work. So I may pause the video here. So again, we're going to go back to high level. We're going to go back to settings and domains right in our same menu here. Now we're just going to add the domain in. So let's see what happens here. Boom. Now it's asking us, where do we want to forward this domain to? Well, let's forward it to our funnel and let's forward it to the claim page. That's pretty cool. Uh, what we also want to do now is we also want to add in the other two domains that we so you'll have your main root domain, plus you'll have a, a www version of this. So www. And then we're going to add in help desk. And let's forward this to the same, same link. Now, I don't have a website developed for help desk. Help desk was just an example of setting up a C name with Go High Level and then adding that into the system. But the same way we've added www here, let's just add help desk dot seven one six dot services. Now I'm just going to hit cancel here. So you're going to notice help desk is here. So I can forward that domain as soon as I make a funnel. Uh, what we're also what we're going to do is we go back to our sites funnels. We click on this and we're going to make sure that we're forwarded to the domain that we want. So hit settings. And notice now that we're forwarded back. So let's just go have a look to see if 716.services works. So this is a preview. This is my page here. It's going to be a three-page offer funnel from one of our other videos. But let's just see if 716.services is working. So it's probably going to take a second or two to kind of resolve here the first time through. Bing! So this is interesting. Our offer actually expired on our funnel. So this is what happens when you go to a funnel on an expired offer. So long story short, this is working. If we wanted to change our funnel or if we wanted to extend our offer, we would need to edit this page. I kind of covered that in a different video. Main point of this video was how do we add a domain in? Uh, how do we connect and attach a domain to the Go High Level landing page. So that's exactly what we've tried to accomplish here. We're trying to make it a short video. Uh, if you want to set up a trial membership, a high level check, I don't think I've posted in here below. But this should get you all the way through setting up uh, a domain and connecting your domain.